Hey, what's going on? You know who it is. You know what it is. All right, man. Um, this is a, a difficult video to make because I'm kind of it's kind of torn. I understand that the rules are rules as far as the NBA goes. Now, keep in mind, um, if Mike Brown gets the Warriors over the hurdle and they win it all. The credit goes to Steve Kerr, even though Steve Kerr has not coached a game thus far, as far as the finals go. Um, man, I'm, I'm gonna make a separate video about uh, about Mike Brown, also him and LeBron James. But um, Steve Kerr, to me, I don't think he should come back if he's gonna get credit for this anyway. As far as him coaching a, a team to a championship, which makes absolutely no sense because he's not out there coaching. It's sort of like a double-edged sword. If Mike Brown wins, Steve Kerr gets credit. It'll officially be on his NBA bio that he coached a team to two championships. I'm telling you right now, man, the NBA, they need to get this shit together. This is the type of shit that people going to find weird. That's like saying, I'll give you an example, man. That's like saying, like, I'll put it you this way. Let's just say, uh, for instance, Sean Porter and Danny, Danny Danny Garcia was about to fight. And uh Danny Garcia got sick and he could <laughs> fight. And then they called Errol Spence here to fight. Sean Porter and like Errol Spence like where's the fight? And they give that a win on Danny Garcia's record. Would that make any kind of sense? That doesn't make any kind of sense. If you are not out there holding the clipboard, calling plays, you should not get credit. So I find that atrocious. It's It doesn't make any kind of sense. But I'm going to talk about Mike Brown in the next video. But y'all catch where I'm going. How you going to get credit for doing something that you didn't do? I know officially you're the team coach, but if you're not physically out there coaching, you should get credit for winning the championship because you did not coach them to a championship. You know, y'all remember last year when um when Bill Walton uh, had to fill in for uh, Steve Kerr when he was out and the Warriors won like 25 straight games. And one of the biggest things was that I said Steve Kerr should not have got credit for those wins because he wasn't out there coaching. So that's something that, yeah, the, the NBA, this is some of the many bullshit things they got going on in the league. They need to fix that. If you're not there physically coaching, you should not get credit for any win. It has to go to the assistant coach. It has to go on their record because that's not fair to them. You know what I'm saying? So, yeah, man, it is what it is, man. Uh, Steve Kerr should just sit out the re the remaining of the playoffs. Don't come back. Let Mike Brown like finish what he started or what he had to do when you couldn't coach. I'm out.